patiently for Lee of China goes up against Shields of the United States of America. Of course, Shields boxing out of the blue corner, the Olympic champion from London 2012, seeing off uh, Ariane fortin Brochu, the French-Canadian in the semi-final in great style. And for Lee of China, a comfortable victory against the Dutch boxer Fong Jin. Well, the 24-year-old Chinese boxer from Inner Mongolia, a university student at uh, Qingdao, silver medalist from the Asian Games, has a tough task here. Clarissa Shields, she's known as T-Rex back in the United States of America. And believe you me, she really does fight like a Tyrannosaurus Rex. She has been most impressive, coached by Jason Crutchfield, only boxing eight years, but the American is determined to add the World Championship gold to the Olympic gold she won in London two years ago at just 17 years of age. The world-ranked middleweight Lee at nine goes up against the world-ranked American boxer Shields one. Gold in the London Olympic Games. Gold in the Pan Am Games. The red corner, Chan Lee from China. The blue corner, Clarissa Shields from United States. And the referee from Kazakhstan. Well, Clarissa Shields, who has uh, come from a very troubled upbringing, has literally fought her way out of Flint in Michigan and this world championship gold will uh, continue her rise to sports stardom not only in the United States of America but across the world now show the speed of her combinations 40 seconds left in the first round <laughs> 25 seconds left on the clock Clarissa Shields Lovely. Right shot there from Shields. Again, strong jab. Incredibly fast right hand. And again, yeah, Clarissa Shields takes her time to find the rhythm, but uh, finishes the first round very nicely. This will be a career best for her, but look at the speed and accuracy of some of these punches in slow motion. And it's the best way to study them when you see the slow motion straight in with the right over the top there, followed by the left jab. There's the right, then the left. Stunning the uh, Chinese boxer. 10-9 from all three judges. So far, so good in round one. For me, what's most impressive about Shields is that she does not get overconfident. She keeps to the task, sticks to the game plan. 
Very little showboating. And for a boxer still only 19 years of age, Shields very mature about her game. Looking for that powerful double jab. She just peppers that jab. The speed of which she moves her punches to the body and then up to the head is electrifying. And here we see Shields again really putting the pressure on Lee. agility from the American she rolls with such ease and fluidity but then look at these punches another big right hand with perfect timing as uh, Lee is moving forwards nice left hook again from uh, Clarissa Shields Lee running out of answers here, not quite sure if she's got anything within her armory, within her skill set to stop Shields here. And again, the Chinese boxer takes two, three big punch combinations from the American. 20 seconds left on the clock in the second round. And again, Shields is in control of this second as she was with the first. Ten on the clock. Four punches to finish off the second round. Two to the body, two to the head from Shields. Bloodying the nose of uh, Lee. And this is what is so impressive from Shields, the ability to there. Downstairs and upstairs, and she's punching at the same time as she's moving with her feet, which makes it so difficult. Look at that right hand there. Spectacular. Well, a 10-8 from Judge C, and that's an indication that Shields really is starting to dominate this uh, final. question now I'm sure many of you are asking can Shields stop this before the fourth Chinese box, the taller of the two. That's the reason why there have been some spectacular body shots. She's trying her best to draw the opponent on by fainting and then step inside and counter to the body and the head. And that's been such an effective tool for the American in blue. Shorter, aggressive style, an inside position, and then. Staying there has been so effective for Shields. Oh, fantastic shot again. A right over the top. Again, three spectacular punch combination. And again, 
So strong with the right hook to the body before attacking the head. Another spectacular round for Clarissa Shields. Broken sweat, does she? There's the right hand on target in the slow mo replay here. Let's look again. Left hook. That's the way I like to see it with the right hook that goes to the body, left jab, then the right hook over the top again. Just such an effective combination. 30-26 from Judge C. The other two judges, Hanva, Shields comfortably three points clear. What she got in store for us in this fourth and final round? Surely Shields has done enough to take the World Championship title. I can watch this lady box all day long, I have to admit. Just so explosive, dynamic, skillful. And uh, make a note of Clarissa Shields' name in your note. Pads back at home. This lady will be a world star. No matter of you, she's determined to defend her Olympic title at Rio in 2016. We're going to be seeing a lot of her in years to come. Still residing in Flint, Michigan, graduating from high school this year. Jason Crutchfield, her coach who she's been living with as part of her preparation for these World Championships, will also be delighted with this performance. And just a problem with the shirt of uh, Lee oh. again uh, counter to Lee just stops the Chinese boxer in her tracks Thirty seconds left now for Shields. Another spectacular display from the American. Twenty now on the clock. Down to ten seconds now. Surely this is America's second gold of this uh, World Championship finale. And there's the bell. Brave performance from Lee, but nowhere near the quality of Clarissa Shields. The 19-year-old American adds the World Championship title to the Olympic gold that she won at 17 years of age, now 19 years of age. The one trophy that was missing from the cabinet, the one accolade that she so desperately wanted to pick off before her 20th birthday, and she's done it in great style here at uh, Jeju Island, or Jeju City, Korea. Wonderful boxing from Clarissa Shields. A joy to watch. Here's the official result. The winner, by 3-0. A unanimous decision, a massive point score. Nice work, Clarissa. Great work from Clarissa Shields. She really has uh, entertained us throughout these World Championships. Her first bout took her 11 seconds. Took her four rounds to take the gold medal, but she's done it in great style.